The powerful call of livability is gaining traction with everyone from millennials to baby boomers. As more people weigh the benefits of living in a megalopolis against the challenges they endure there, many are opting for smaller communities. I think people are choosing smaller communities over the larger cities for quality of life issues. The cost of living is less, housing is more affordable, commute times are less. If you live 20 miles away, you can be to work in 20 minutes. It's just a better way to live. Beyond escaping the stresses of big city living, what most people are looking for is the opportunity to truly enhance their quality of life. When people move from big cities to smaller communities, uh, they still have expectations of a better life for themselves and their family. They expect a place with good educational opportunities. They want rich culinary, cultural, and, and lifestyle options. And I think they can find that in the smaller cities. It's important to find a community that has a strong economy and a thriving business community. Communities need businesses to be strong economically, and business communities need to be striving to provide job opportunities and great tax base for support of our local services. A strong economy provides job opportunities. Job opportunities means there's workforce development. Workforce development means there is property tax support, and that means quality of life. That combination of a desirable quality of life and a supportive business environment is creating steady growth for small communities like Walla Walla, Washington. We have a great quality of life here in part because we have a terrific port that supports a lot of heavy and light industrial business. We have a prime location for that with water transportation on the Columbia River. It's got rail and underground gas transmission lines and we're fortunate that it's uh, ideally located 30 miles from our primary population center. Our business community is supported through workforce development, an educated labor force. That provides the employees necessary to support the businesses. We also provide adequate infrastructure such as highway investments, rail investment, navigation support of the river system, and we have adequate land inventory that's properly zoned for manufacturing. Our port has been tremendous for uh, industry and the economy in this community. It provides uh, a lot of employment with the businesses that it brings in. They pay a lot of property tax. In addition to industrial commerce, we're also fortunate to have a very thriving wine industry. We've been planting vineyards for the last 15 years, building wineries, and our restaurants have been maturing as well. With all of that comes tourism, and with tourism comes jobs in the restaurants, jobs in the vineyards, and the wineries. People have been traveling all around the world to come here to work in our industry and bring all of their skills and talents to our Walla Walla. Discover Walla Walla, Washington. This vibrant community is attracting new businesses, residents, and tourists with its scenic beauty, rich heritage, and thriving economy. The city of Walla Walla itself is actually older than the state of Washington. It was once the territorial capital of the Oregon Territory. We have a rich heritage and cultural history that's part of what attracts people here today. We have the longest continuously running symphony west of the Mississippi and at least four live theater groups and a chamber music organization. We have three colleges, two private and a wonderful community college that has won a national award as being the best community college in the nation. You don't expect to find that in a city of 30,000 people or a county of 60,000. Businesses are growing and thriving in our community due to proximity to big markets. Our region is growing, the Northwest is growing, and our properties are located strategically between good markets. I think another big part of the renaissance of this community has certainly been the wine industry. It's contributed to an increase in tourism and really has become a big part of our identity now. In 1985, we had only three wineries and today we have over 120. And with that has drawn a lot of interest from around the world for people to move to Walla Walla, plant vineyards, build wineries, and be a part of our community. The Port of Walla Walla supports business expansion and development. We become partners with our local industries and that is why they are successful. We have great weather, lots of sunshine, scenic beauty, tremendous education opportunities here, and a vibrant arts community. Our housing is still affordable, and when people work here, they can go home for lunch, or they can leave work at 5, be at their kids' soccer game at 5.05. These are the kinds of things that appeal to people. Isn't it time you discovered Walla Walla? Find out more at co.walla-walla.wa.us.